What up, Jippers? Our place back once again for some more No Man's Sky and our beautiful space adventures. And just lately, they have been extra beautiful. And this planet that I'm on, that we touched down in at the end of the last episode, is definitely helping to keep things very pretty at the moment. Because the trees here, this crazy blue and red like combo mix that seems to be going on everywhere on all the different types of trees is pretty freaking sweet. Uh, I've got a couple more creatures to try and discover here, so we're going to have a little bit of a bumble around and see what we can find. Uh, have a little bit of jipping and japping. Ooh, I see ya. Oh, this guy's cool. I, oh, I remember, what was that base that I had, like that homeworld I had ages ago that was freaking beautiful? I think I called it like heaven or something. Heaven, was it heaven or something like that? I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. I found a beautiful planet. Uh, with loads of these creatures with this crazy, like, white face. Totally different body to this. Uh, but that crazy looking white head that you can just never forget once you've seen it. And it took me a long time to find one of these. Like, now I've seen quite a few of them. But I hadn't seen one of those weird heads, like, ever. And then when I found that first planet, it was pretty cool. Oh, this looks nice. I'm going to take less pictures. I'm going to... I'm really trying hard to crack my addiction, guys. We're going to... Whoa. Okay, that looks cool. We're going to head over there. Wait, are there any creatures that I missed? Yeah, I'm really trying hard to take less pictures in my episodes. Because I know so, like some people don't mind that. Um, and I know a lot of people when they play are the same as me. Like, they'll just take loads of pictures of everything. Because it's also pretty. Uh, but I know there's a couple of people that watch it. And they're like, just get on with it. We want to walk around. We want to see stuff. So we're going to try really hard to do that. If I do relapse, you guys are going to have to work as my guidance counsellors. <laughs> You're going to have to remind me in the comments, like, nope, that was too many. Stop. Stop doing that. Uh, and we'll hopefully, you know, we'll, we're on the road to recovery, guys. The addiction photo mode is just, it's real, you know. <laughs> uh, right. How I can see so many dots, but none of them are creatures I haven't found yet. I really like these guys, like, walking around together in their little crew. <laughs> I feel like they need little leather jackets on them. They'd look hilarious. <laughs> right, okay, anyway. Back to this monolith. This thing looks cool as hell. I want to go grab this. I am going to take a picture of the monolith, of course. I mean, that's a pretty special looking monolith, if you ask me. I've seen some stuff, you know. I've seen some monoliths in the game, but I, uh, I don't very often find one that looks this cool. So, a picture of... Ooh. Ugh. <laughs> oh no, he's got six legs. I hate it. I hate it when they've got too many legs. When they look like a pretty regular, not like earth cattle animal, but like a, a cattle herd animal that looks kind of what you'd expect. And then you realize they've got way too many legs and it just creeps me the hell out. Oh, he's really tubby as well. <laughs> How do you even move like that? And that looks crazy uncomfortable. What a guy. What a nipper. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get out of here, buddy. I ain't messing with no police. All right, let's go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get a picture of this. I know. I said I'm going to take a picture, so give me a break. Give me a break. It's all fine. I'm going to crank up that fog. This is my new thing. This is my new <laughs> Now that I've started putting the fog to 500, I'm like, yeah. The fog should always be at 500. Like, it just looks freaking awesome. For sure. Ooh, ooh, ooh. If I can get that, that planet. In oh, yeah. If I, can, uh, if I can do this right, this could be a really special picture, right? Oh, that's probably a bit too far away, though, isn't it, from the monolith? Oh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Let me get close to the monolith. I don't want the monolith to be covered in the fog. That's the only thing. I, well, I guess I could get, like, a really cool one of the monolith. And then worry about getting the planet in. Oh, that looks nice. Ooh. Yeah, I think we the. Uh, <laughs> I think we found a good little uh, place for a couple of snaps here, haven't we? Jeez Louise. This, God, this game is so pretty. Like, I don't know. Like, just... <laughs> People are like, how do you like this game? And I'm like, look at it. It looks fantastic. Exploring, like, beautiful worlds in this game is just one of, like, the best things for me. Like, I don't understand how how people don't get it, you know? Whoa, there's a lot of planets up there. That's pretty crazy. Huh. I really like this monolith. Like, a lot. I like it a lot. I'm going to take one with without the fog. Uh, because that will help me get... Oh, restore defaults. There we go. Because that should help me get the planets in the background. If I go, whoa, 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 how have I gone so high up? There we go. No, 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 Whoa, 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 there we go. <laughs> I'm having a technical breakdown, guys. Give me a break. All right, here we go, here we go. Somewhere like here? Oh, it looks so good. It looks so good. Oh, gosh. Okay, right. I'll have to do that off camera, because otherwise I'll be here all day. <laughs> uh, but let's go get it and see what it says. Which, hello? Which way do I want to go? Ooh. What did that say? What did that? I thought that said shop. 
can't say shop. I must have imagined that. Oh, restless sleep. <laughs> For he said restless shop. I was like, what are you selling me, boy? Uh, the body of a warrior emerges from the obelisk, a jagged tear in the midriff, suggesting that the dangerous looking multi tool that sits in their hand was not enough to save them. It was not enough. The surface of the sculpt. The sculpted rock blurs and shows images of military worship. It's trying to tell me something. Bury the soldier and the multi-tool. Take the multi-tool and leave. I'm going to try. I think that's not going to work. I'm going to get attacked. I take the multi-tool from the body. I'm about to turn and leave. Oh no! I got shocked! I knew that was not the right... I got a new multi-tool. Oh, oh. Oh yeah, I can compare. Mine's got more slots than that, right? Oh. Oh, it does have more slots, but everything in it is broken, and that's going to take me years, so I'm just going to... Oh no, my stat! I've been demoted! Demoted! Gypped again! I, I should have gone for the good thing. I always like this. The answer in those things is always like, do the right thing, you know? <laughs> As in life, guys. Don't, <laughs> don't be a rebel, you know? Don't go around bullying people or stealing their multi-tools. Especially when next comes along. You little jippers be out there trying to steal my multi-tools, I'm going to be... Equipped to my plasma grenades. <gasps> oh, just as I said that, my uh, my thing is depleted. There we go. Let's fill it up. 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 There's always sirens outside my house. <laughs> uh, right. Okay. We got everything here. Where are all these creatures that I haven't found yet? What are you? Oh, that's just him. I thought that was like a big white horn or something on his face. Plutonium. My favorite. My favorite. Isotope with clout. Chris and I, Chris. Oh yeah, I got the advanced mining laser. That's right. <gasps> when did the grass become blue? Oh, this planet is. What the system I'm in right now is unreal. Hello. No, nope, no, nope, I got you already. I know there's some creatures around here that I haven't got somewhere. It's just a matter of time. I want to see little frog-like creatures. That'd be cool. If you just saw like a little tiny mini toad like hopping around. <laughs> Man, the grass looks so good like that. There's something about that. Oh, you know what? That reminds me of um. Slushies, you know, are they called slushies in America? I know most of you guys are American. Are they called slushies? Slush puppies? Ice drinks? You know, like the crushed ice, uh... They're probably called slushies, right? Y you guys know what I'm talking about. Well, I always get the mixy flavour, and I always get red and blue, like, every single time. So when the grass was, like, blurring, like, the red into the blue, that's the colour that it reminded me of. That, like, weird purple colour, but you can still see the red and blue rather than it just being purple. Why do I always think about food and drink when I play this game? It's because it looks so tasty. <laughs> I can't find any of these little nippers. I'm being gypped. There's like, there's definitely more creatures for me to find. Yeah, there's another three. And I can't see any of them. Hmm. Where are you? Oh, maybe they're like... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? Huh. I thought that was going to be a huge ravine or something. Doo, doo, doo. These trees are my favourite thing. Look at them. How cool does that look? Oh! Oh! <laughs> I bet that's Carlos up at my home base again. <laughs> How's it going, buddy? I will gaze upon you from the stars. Different planets, so far away, but yet so close. Uh, right, where do we... Where do we want to go? Where do we think these creatures... I bet they're flying creatures. I bet that's why I'm missing them. No, but they can't all be flying. There's three more. They can't all be flying. Whoa, whoa! Get out of here, fool. Ha! <laughs> Wrecked him. I don't see him. I don't see the little nippers. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hello? I know, like, I never normally struggle to find the creatures when there's three left. It's normally, like, when I've only got two left at the most. But usually it's only, like, the last one that takes me a while to find. They're extra sneaky on this planet, huh? They probably heard me coming. <laughs> I mean, like, imagine in real life if I was actually, like, exploring and trying to find rare creatures and stuff. I would never be able to sneak up and track down a creature and get a picture of it, would I? I'd just be like, Hell's Bells, there he is, let's go! And the creature would just, like, hear me from a mile off. <laughs> Uh, right, okay. I'm, I'm like, debating whether I should stay here and find these creatures or go... This is in my system, right? So we can literally just hop over here anytime we... <gasps> Launch thrusters. I ain't got them charged. This is dangerous. Dangerous territory. What if I get attacked? How am I going to escape? What am I doing? All oh, right, okay. Here we go. <laughs> that was embarrassing. <laughs> Completely wrong menu. How many t how many episodes have I played, guys? And I'm still pressing the wrong buttons. Uh, Launch thruster. There we go. We've got plenty of plutonium. Technology recharged. I want that to be my text message tone. No, I thought he was going to be a creature I hadn't got. Hmm, that's weird. 
I'll watch me like fly off and I'll just see a bird that I haven't spotted like, as I'm about to leave. We'll just do some upside down flying. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Okay, let's just go straight out. <laughs> I forgot that the controls, of course, switch direction when you're upside down, but what can you do? Okay, we got a nice... Oh, I can... Wait, can I buy a freighter? I've got 33 million. I'm kind of in that attitude at the moment where I'm just like... Let's blow it all. Let's let's not worry about anything. Let's not worry about saving money, stockpiling resources. Let's just go nuts. Because I've got a feeling that when next comes, I'm going to be restart. I'm pretty confident that I am going to restart the game. And I actually am quite convinced that the multiplayer mode, like the full multiplayer experience, is going to be one that you have to restart for. So I'm kind of like, even though I was probably hoping to save up loads and get the best freighter, now, because I never owned a freighter, I'm just kind of like, let's do it. Whoa, 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 let's just blow it. Let's blow all of our money and buy a freighter. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna buy a freighter, guys. Can I can I buy one of these? Whoa, 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 whoa. Turn around, turn around. I don't know why I keep saying whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Apparently that's my catch freighter. That's not even a that's not a pretty freighter. I wanna I wanna spend all the money. I wanna go nuts and have a good time, but man. Hold on a minute. Hold up. Hold up. This is beautiful. Wow. Look at that for a scene in space. Jeez Louise. Ha! Man, that looks cool as hell. I just completely, like, stumbled upon that as well. Like, I wasn't even trying to line up to get a good shot or anything. But that looks freaking cool, right? Man, I love this game. This is just... <laughs> I don't know if you guys have noticed. I mean, I don't know if I ever mentioned that. Uh, <laughs> I'm a pretty big fan. Uh, right, okay. That was cool. That was very cool. I never get any pictures with my ship. Do you know, I'll be honest, like, ever since I had... If anyone's been here for a long time, you'll remember a ship that I used to have called the Winged Frog. You know exactly what I'm talking about. It was a great big green 48 slot A-class hauler, and it was freaking awesome. Um, is that... That's not my home base over there, is it? Oh, yeah, of course it is. Uh, yeah, and it was beautiful. And, I like, I've always missed it ever since I... Uh, ever since I got rid of it. Ever since I no longer had it. So I kind of think, like, when next comes along, unless they add a whole load of new ships, they're going to add new ships. They're totally going to add new ships. So let's decide once we see them. Have I been to this planet? I'm going to get out of this system because I don't know what planets I've been to and which ones I haven't because uh, Carlos has discovered some of them as well. He was the person we met in the last episode. That was so freaking cool. That was, like, just such a great moment for me in the game. Like, for real, that was so awesome. Uh, let's do it. Let's go to the Atlas station. Oh, yeah, that's I'm meant to be doing the Atlas storyline, by the way, guys. And I've just realised I've, I've jabbered on too much that my tea's going to have gone freezing cold. <laughs> cold tea is not great. I mean, cold tea is better than no tea, but it's not the best. Whoa. That looks freaking awesome. That looks really freaking awesome. I love the music. What have we got? What have we got? How many... Oh, hello. Hello there. Oh, this looks nice. I've warped 60 times! This is not my first playthrough as well, guys. So if you're thinking, that's not much. I think I've restarted the game like three times. And I also have a creative save. I used to have another creative save that I played all the time, but I deleted it. And I've got um, my PC mode. Like, I play on PC sometimes as well. I could go there. Do you want to go there? I'm going to go to the Atlas station. I feel like we've not done that in an episode together for ages, right? Am I doing better at not taking pictures? I feel like I'm doing a really good job of not taking pictures today. I know we took two pic I know we took pictures, but, <laughs> but you know what I mean? Like, it wasn't, like, normally I just can't stop taking pictures. Right, leave me alone. You're a bunch of bullies. You're a bunch of jippers. All right, let me in there. Oh, I almost went to take a picture of me going into the station because it looks so cool, but then I thought, no, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm rehabilitated. Whoa, that's freaky. You would never fly towards this thing. If I <laughs> if I saw this thing and I was actually flying around, I'd be like, nope, turn it around, go the other way. No, thank you. The Atlas would call to me and I'd just be like, sorry, no signal, no answer. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's run around. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me have my ship. Come on. I keep. Why do I keep saying, whoa, whoa, whoa? Where's that coming from? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, here we go. Here we go. I'm going to put out all the light. Woo, bright lights. Man, this place looks so cool. Have I ever, like, properly looked around in here? Oh. Oh, my gosh. The, that's the abyss. The entire universe stems from this single point. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get out of here. I, I'm really annoying myself by saying, whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Stop it! You know when you get something stuck in your head, and then you try not to say it, or like hum it, or sing it, and then you just can't stop doing it? That's what's happened to me today, guys. I should just call this episode, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got. Uh, that's exactly what it said, by the way. I was born with everything I needed to explore these worlds. My exosuit, my ship, every tool and every impulse led me to scan and give name to whatever I could find. It's true. But this, I can give no name to what I see. Within the orb, I see worlds that never were. I see the stirring of something primal and undeniable. I see the death cry of a god. Or something approaching it. It wants me to persist. Pers persist? Pers <laughs> I got braces, leave me alone. <laughs> it wants me to persist in this journey, seeking fragments of its interface. Uh, the stones. Yeah, okay, so we gotta go get the stones. Milestone, Rosetta, or above. Concede. Well, I'm gonna do that. I will commit myself to the voyage. Bon voyage, travelers. Uh, in all things, I am ready. I will not falter. <laughs> I ain't scared. New product. New spheric orb. New spheric orb. That was a nice, nice sound to it, doesn't it? New spheric. Hmm. I like that. An atlas seed capable of resonating on humanoid telepathic frequencies may attempt to subsume any subordinate intellect in close proximity. <laughs> I love the way they just thought, let's see how many long words we can fit into a sentence there. <laughs> so I need an englobed shade and some nickel. And I don't have a dime. An englobed shade. Golly gosh. Alright, well, see you later, buddy. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll go check out that that planet quickly before we leave. Okay, here we go. Down to another planet now that we're out of the Atlas Station. Uh, hopefully, this is going to... Oh, I didn't scan it. I didn't scan it. I don't know what kind of planet it's going to... What the heck is this? Oh, this looks interesting. <laughs> I didn't scan it to see what kind of planet it is. And now I'm kind of excited because this looks weird as heck. Yes! Oh! Oh, these are like the best exotic planets as well. Oh, this is freaking... I found another one of these. Like, I'd never... I think like I found an exotic planet. Not this kind. A different kind of exotic planet. And what was it? Like two episodes ago, maybe? And I was saying how I'd never ever find exotic planets. And now I've just found another one. And this is my favorite type of exotic planet. This. Whoa, whoa. Oh, no, no. Oh, there's an extreme sentinel planet, huh? <laughs> Good. I'll kill all of you. Come bring me some zinc. <laughs> I ain't scared of you drones. We're going to get killed, aren't we? I'm so dead. Bring it, boy. Let me switch to my popper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ha, ha, ha. Sucker! You're dead now. <laughs> gypped him, gypped him, gypped him. How are they going to come up? Oh, whoa. I never noticed these things float around. Oh, that's cool. I think. Oh, actually, now I think I might have only seen this kind of exotic when I've been playing in my modded series. I don't know if I've actually seen one in, like, in the base game. Have I seen one of these in my in this this series that I'm playing now? Or is it only in my modded series? I'm not sure now. It could actually... Oh, that looks cool. Is this one of those times where I'm allowed to take a picture? I think so. I think this is a pretty special... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, it doesn't look so good in the daytime, though, huh? It looks really cool at nighttime, though. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, right. Let's... Should we crank the fog up and see how that looks in the background there? I feel like that could be... Oh, this could be really cool. If this looks how I imagine it's going to look. Come on. Hit me with that fog, boy! Oh, it doesn't look as cool as I thought it was going to look. Maybe if I get closer. Yeah, yeah, so we get some glow in there. Oh, yes! Okay, that looks great. That looks fantastic. Man, I like. I am just... Yeah, I'm having a great time at the moment. <laughs> Finding cool thing after cool thing. Do we want to, like... So, in the last exotic planet I found, I know there were the thing, those ring things that had lore that I missed. I didn't realize. I'm sorry, guys. I had no idea that you could go and get lore from them. I probably have done it or known about it once before, but, like, i just forgotten. And, um, so I missed it. But I don't think you get lore from this planet, though, right? Come here! I can't catch him! No! This barrel's gonna be the death of me! I'm gonna run after it, trying to get the loot, and then the things are gonna kill me, but... Oh, no, no, no. Let's fire some grenades in that direction. Uh. <laughs> As if I actually hit him from there! That's hilarious! <laughs> oh, they deactivated! That's it! Brilliant! That's pretty funny. I was not expecting to actually be able to hit him. Oh, we are about to get some in some serious trouble, but I'm gonna grab them and run. Quick! Did I get them all? No, there's more. There's more. Is there more? It's too bright. Grab them all! 
Grab them all! The elite Sentinel Force is coming for me! Run! Time to get the hell out of here! I gotta get close to my ship and then I might actually try and fight them. I've never, like, I've never survived, basically. I was gonna say I've never tried to fight them. I have tried to fight them. I always die. You are gonna get wrecked. Oh, you l oh. How come I hit that one earlier with, like, an incredible shot? And now they're, like, right next to me. I can't hit them. Huh! Oh, oh, you're lucky. It is your lucky day, punk. Oh, yeah! Who's next? It says elite. Oh, that's the dog, isn't it? The puppy's the elite one. Come here, boy! Fido's about to die, though. Ha <laughs> ha! Chipped him! Get out of here! Well, I'm feeling extra uh, malicious today. <laughs> Get him! <laughs> Too much waking Titan wear stuff. <gasps> run! 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 Shield! 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 No, oh, no, I'm dead! I'm dead! Why am I running? Why can't I run? I can't run! Why can't I run? No, no, no! Why can't I run? I can't run! It won't let me run! What's happening? Oh golly, that was terrifying. Get in the ship. Get in the ship! We're out of here! This is why I don't fight them. Oh, okay, we're in the jet beam. We're safe. Everything's safe. Oh. <laughs> and I think that is going to do it for this episode, guys. What an adventure. I just want to like, are they still out there? Are they, <laughs> are they still just uh, prowling around out here trying to kill me? Oh, he's coming for me. Oh, it's like that episode of Black Mirror. You know, the like robot droid thing, dog things that chase that... Uh, Shit, was it the... I can't remember. I think there's like a woman that's trying to escape or something. That was a cool episode. That's what they remind me of. Oh, they're terrifying. All right, guys. <laughs> that's enough Jibber Jabbering for me. Hopefully you enjoyed that one. If you did enjoy it, uh, please do drop a like and a comment. That stuff helps like crazy. And of course, I appreciate it. Uh, if you do want to support me that little bit extra, I have got a Patreon now. And the purpose of the Patreon is because one day I would really love to be able to do more. And I would love to be able to do this as like my main thing, you know, my main focus in life. Uh, so, you know, with a bit of luck and a bit of support, maybe one day we'll get there. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much if you do support me that way. And if you do want to grab some cool, nifty little Jipper merch, the link for my merch store will be in the description and the pinned comment below as well. And if you do anything like that, make sure you share the pictures with me because that would be cool as hell. <laughs> but yeah, that's going to do it, guys. Take care of yourselves and peace. I just want to give a huge thank you and shout out to my current Patreon supporters, Shiroka Majelli, Wyo, Madeline J, UK Gamer 84, Todd Cook, Neil B, Anarchy, Vanilla, Rasmus K, Mingrui, Dale from the Atlas Hub, Joannes Anderson, Heath, and the Portrait Dude. You guys are the best. Mm -hmm.